Hey Familia, Igni here and welcome back to Shadverse. Yes, I know the channel's been sort of dead for a couple days, and by a couple I mean like 20 days, but I promise, I promise you, I am working on stuff. There's content coming down the pipe, but for now I thought I'd let you know that hey, I'm not dead, I'm still working on stuff, and I thought I'd share with you a little experiment that I've been playing around with. It's a Maelstrom Serpent Vengeance deck. It's not super optimized yet or anything, I only just started playing with it, really. Uh, so there's definitely changes to be made, but I thought I'd share with you what I got so far, and it's been fun so far to win with uh, massive snacks that nobody ever sees coming. So basically what you do is, you, you know, it's vengeance. You can either go fast by playing the Belphegor or the Blood Moon early, and then getting the Dark Generals and Dark Air Jammers down, and it works with Emeralda later on. Or you can extend the game a little bit, remove their stuff, and then land the Maelstrom Serpent for a gigantic board of a bunch of 5-5s, five which is always fun. Let's just jump into it. I'm gonna full mulligan this. I don't like this hand. Not against Haven. I don't want, uh... The Hungering Horde in this matchup, I don't think. Like, what's it gonna kill Snow White? Not very effective, right? Alright, we're gonna pass our turn. We get it back anyway. Cause that's fine. Yurius comes out next turn. There she is! Mm-hmm. <laughs> If I play the Urias, I just I think he's just gonna banish it. Oh, well, feeling he has Black Inscripture in hand. Might as well get draw off. They always keep Black Inscripture in hand, so. Oh, he doesn't have it. If he doesn't have it, that's fine by me. <laughs> Everyone misses to give you a 2 3. Oh, that was ridiculous. I don't know why I'm getting nostalgic now, but. That was gross. I guess it doesn't really matter. What my health total is, I'm gonna probably Belphegor next turn. Or I could go for a Mask now and then Belphegor next turn. He probably can't come through the 5 with his board. This way I get to draw 2 cards and not take any damage. I don't know he's gonna deal 4. He needs Angel the Word. She does not have. That's interesting, though. I can't get through that. <laughs> That's interesting. Alright, there's my Blood Gnome. Do I pre-evolve this? I don't want to just be able to trade one. Banish. I don't mind pre-evolving. I have a lot of answers in hand. Yeah, it's a bummer. Worth it, though. I think it was worth it. I establish the Blood Moon now? I want to draw into my Serpent. Sooner rather than later. Might be worth it. Plus I have the second Belphegor in hand to make this work. Seems kind of flaccid. Unless you, uh, got something else. Oh yeah, oof. Ooh, that's, that's a buff. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> oh no. I was not expecting that, frankly. I'm powerless. For now. I think this more or less works out fine. Unless you got Dark, uh, not Dark John, regular John, Bacon John in hand. Bacon John would be very sad for me right now. Bacon John. But nobody runs Bacon John anymore, right? Nobody runs Bacon John anymore, right? Don't do it. Don't do it. I can't, I'm not looking. I can't look. Okay, if he had it, he would have played it by now. Good. That'll work. I guess, I guess I just hope that it hits the Fallen Angel. Uh, what other options do I got right now? I should have attacked with the Fallen Angel first so I could stay in Vengeance. Nice. Not that it matters if he has a black in scripture though. I'll take the small victories where I can get him. Nobody runs! John, Beacon of Salvation anymore. Everyone's running Fall from Grace because of Beauty and the Beast. I don't blame him. I don't blame him at all. Alright, calm down. I can't understand what you're saying. Alright, this is a Razory Claw into Airjammer, I think. 
Yeah. Of course it drew double Baphomet. I mean, I guess that makes sense. I already have two spider of Is it only Baphomet left in the deck, actually? That's still a lot of Void Presence, at least. He doesn't run Bacon John, so it's fine. Either he doesn't run it or he didn't draw it. I think he doesn't run it. Well, I can kill it, though. Not that big a deal. Justice can never die. This is my home. This is my home. I don't really want to heal with Scarlet right now. I want to stay in vengeance for now. That's a problem. That's a very big problem. Somehow we're doing okay. Oh, oh, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> can't attack face with your Baja, man. Your Baja, your Baja can't go face, my friend. <laughs> Hello? Moshi Moshi. Um, okay. Okay. Hey, there he is. There's my guy. My best boy. Just don't have second Baja and I think I win. Or second, uh, or another Heavenly Knight. He's already played two. I think it's unlikely that he has the third one in hand with only two cards. D no, 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 don't do it. No, don't do it. <laughs> don't you dare. That's not Heavenly Knight. If he had it, he would have played it. If he had it, he would have played it. Okay, breathe easy. All right, don't panic. I want to win with my snakes, damn it. Let me hit you in the face with my big snake. Look at all that five on the board. But I have six defense. It ruined everything. I've only had one less defense right now. Yeah, I know, right? You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, 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 get him. Oh, beautiful. Wrecked by the snack. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. It's only game. Why you have to be mad? Oh, he's really making a countdown all the way to the end, huh? Yeah, there you go. Got there. You can't be this salty about losing to a meme. Come on. Yeah, that seems good. <laughs> Oh, this is one of the matchups where I wish I had Fall From Grace in the deck. I really wish I had Fall From Grace in the deck. I used to have Fall From Grace in the deck and then I took it out because I was like... And it's not good against Mid Shadow. And other things. It's only good against BNB, really. And, uh, well, look where we are now. Also drawing both of my Maelstrom Serpents, not exactly where I want to be. I think I have a third one in the deck, too. Which is worrying. Maybe if I just go fast enough, he'll... Slow his goddamn roll. And I can kill him before BNB comes out. So then it's Balfagor into Dark General after this. Bliss. Let's do it. He's gonna twin elf here. No! Oh, lucky! Lucky! Yeah, I have to Balfagor. I can't take this slow. I just can't take this slow. It has to happen. Do I kill this? Yes. The answer is yes. What am I talking about? Of course I kill it. He's gonna kill me otherwise. Alright. Alright. Okay, here's the Twin Elves. Yes! Yes! No Twin Elves! Oh, lucky! Oof. Woo! I was so scared. I was so afraid. Sometimes fortunate. He empowers me. And then I hit him in the face. Hit him very hard. Just go away. Just die. Okay? No no BNP allowed, right? Nerd. He's gonna play BNB next turn, that's for sure. I have Emeralda though. Go ham. We're going in! 
Ah, well, good game. <laughs> <laughs> when you got Belphegor, you win. What? Oh, no, I mean, I still win, it's fine. I was afraid for a second, but then I wasn't anymore. Because Emeralda's a good card. I was just shocked that it wasn't Beauty and the Beast for once. But this works out fine for me. Yep. Gotta get him real fast before uh, all that neutral shenanigans comes down. Glad I got him one turn before Saha. And that's my build of Maelstrom Serpent right now. If there's something that I would change from this point, it's probably adding more removal. It's hard to address their threats sometimes. It's kind of hard to fit in good ones, because Blood lost a lot of tools with the rotation, huh? But if you can go fast enough or land the Serpents on time because of the lack of board clear, you just run them over, which is really nice. That's it for this video. Like it if you did. Don't if you didn't. Subscribe for more Shadowverse content in the very near future. I promise I'm working on stuff, even though it may not seem like it. Thank you very much for watching. And of course, thank you to my wonderful patrons, patreon.com slash if you'd like to support the channel as well. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.